Hello once again audience and welcome back to Dominations with Mac Marlin Christopher. Hi. We wanted to give you guys a quick update. You know what you're looking at? That is the head-to-head -head matchup between the Outlaws and Invictus Army. We are extremely excited. The search happened through um, oh through. It was established and the communication went through Discord uh, complement with the spreadsheet that it was kindly kind of put together uh, by Clint from Prodigal Thieves and it was coordinated earlier on today between Ambria who is now the new leader of Invictus Army. Congratulations on that promotion. Um, yeah, so we coordinated a 30 versus 30 uh, by using that metric and the start times and we were very happy that the search only took, oh, I would say 10 to 15 seconds. As you can see, there's, uh, well, this screenshot is new. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, from this morning, almost uh, immediately after that it happened. So, let's see if we can get rid of that. And where is window capture? There it is. Okay. So, we go back in here. Denominations. Big, huge games. In a Christopher voice. In a Christopher that voice. That was good. That was really good. We're excited to see this happen. Um, you know, one time, I, uh, the first time that we actually battled with Invictus Army, obviously it was new. We weren't sure if it, entirely if it was going to work, and it was a lot of uh, diligence was put in by Ambria, and then of course they beat the pants off of us. But this time we're a little bit more prepared. A lot more prepared, and I think it was both a surprise for both um, sort of alliances, because clearly we had been going up against not very challenging. <laughs> Well, and even now, Alliances. even now I find that we're, you know, people are like, well, who should I take for my second? And it's like, I don't um, know. On our top end, maybe, but our bottom end has really been struggling. Yes. Um, so we did increase the metric and we went with the 30 versus 30, which is not really standard for us. We're used to 20 to 25 is usually what we war with. And the increase in that metric, I think, has really helped. Yeah, so we might continue on this way, even if that means including a few inactives. Well, we'll see how it plays out. Yeah. But, I mean, they've got, like, their 30s in Medieval, and then they jump to the Gunpowder, looking at us, down at the very bottom. Uh, we've got two, and then it jumps to the Gunpowder, so not really that bad. Um, and then from there, Gunpowder, Gunpowder, Gunpowder. Their gunpowder uh, up to 19. 19, really w up to 15, I would say. Cause or, yeah, up to 16, maybe. 16, we'll say. Uh, and then we are gunpowder. I know Clan is enlightened. So, yeah, see, we start enlightened at 17. Yeah. But we go straight from gun gunpowder to, oh, gunpowder to enlightened at... 1817, right, and then our industrials start at 13. Where do their industrials start at? 12. So there's a little bit of give and take. Yeah. Um, but certainly, you know, having it within one, I think, is a lot more doable than in the past what we've come across. Yeah, where our gunpowders are up against industrial age bases. That, mm -hmm. I can't imagine that being a whole lot of fun. Um, no, nor can I. This tablet's huge. Um, no, it really wouldn't be. And that's yeah. that was kind of the discussion that Marla and I had amongst ourselves was, uh, and I think we did vet it with some people. How do we actually improve that so that it's yeah, not so, so off? Yeah, because I mean, I want everybody in my alliance to experience success. And, you know, um, and I certainly don't want uh, to exclude, 
younger aged people from war because I mean if you're gonna be a good war attacker you should be starting as soon as you can yeah um, absolutely and I mean I think there's a little more give when you're at the younger ages I mean for people to cover up for you <sighs> If you make mistakes, you know, like that. You're supposed to make mistakes, though. I think that's that's kind of the progress of the game, and yeah. you're getting tenure in the game, and in your age. It's a lot easier to clean up. If you're making mistakes as a, a gunpowder, or even a medieval, versus or even trying an to enlightened, and I mean, I'm not saying that uh, even rush to enlightened and yeah. I'm, in industrial age, I've made mistakes more, but I mean, it's... Yeah. 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 But the point is that we were able to get a successful matchup the second time around using these metrics, and we're very thrilled. Um, our average was actually within 0.5, which is very important, impressive, I think, for a 30 versus 30 to have that average line up. Uh, if you're an alliance leader, uh, and you're interested in warring and think that you are undefeated, we'd love to see some action from you. I will put the link to the Discord channel down below in the description. Yeah. Uh, and we hope to see you over there. Yeah. Uh, let's get it going. Let's what do we say? Going. Keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time. I can say have a good time. Yeah, you can do that? Yeah. Okay. Keep your sticks on the ice. Have a good time.